Aside from the unfortunate news involving center Michael Deiter, the Miami Dolphins got a clean bill of health on the final injury report of the week heading into their game against the Indianapolis Colts at Hard Rock Stadium on Sunday. On the other side, the Colts have injury issues galore. Let's start with the Dolphins, who don't have one player with a game status designation other than Deiter, who head coach Brian Flores said Friday morning would be headed to injured reserve because of an injury sustained in practice earlier this week. That includes wide receiver Will Fuller v, who missed practice Wednesday with chest and elbow issues, and same goes for linebacker Jerome Baker, who was limited in practice Wednesday because of a hamstring injury. Additionally, every player other than Deiter was a full participant in practice Friday. With Fuller playing, the Dolphins again will have a tough decision to make when it comes to which wide receiver to make inactive against the Colts. Preston Williams and Albert Wilson both were inactive against the Raiders in Week 3 when the Dolphins used Fuller, Devontae Parker, rookie first-round pick Jalen Waddell, Mac Hollins and receiver, returner Jakeem Grant. The Colts ruled out five players Friday, most notably guard Quentin Nelson. The three-time All-Pro selection sustained a high ankle sprain in a loss against Tennessee last Sunday and will miss his first game since being a first-round pick in the 2018 draft. The Colts also will play Sunday without starting right tackle Braden Smith, who was ruled out with foot and thumb injuries. Beyond those two, starting quarterback Carson Wentz, starting running back Jonathan Taylor and starting guard Mark Glowinski all were listed as questionable, though Wentz played with two sprained ankles against Tennessee last Sunday. Taylor and Glowinski both are dealing with knee injuries. Also ruled out by the Colts were rookie first-round pick Quiti Pei, the defensive end from Michigan who's dealing with a hamstring issue, safety Karis Willis, ankle, groin, and cornerback Rakia Sin, ankle. All-pro linebacker Darius Leonard was cleared to play, though he was limited in practice the past two days with an ankle injury after not practicing Wednesday. 